Ichiro Nagatani. There were only a few who walked this path. Kenso Kora. Who can stand here today and know the journey. I had uh, five brothers. Uh, one was right there. <laughs> Terry Takamoto was forced with her entire family to go down the Bainbridge Island dock that stood here and into the unknown, excluded, detained, held in an internment camp for Japanese Americans after then President Franklin Roosevelt signed an executive order during World War II. That was March 30th, 1942. Today is about survivors. Terry and a handful of others returned to the spot, now a national park, a national reminder of the horrors of the time. Nidoto Nayoni, we resolve that the wrongs of 1942 not be repeated again. Sometimes healing only happens if you work at it. Understanding our history helps create an understanding of what happened to you, which encourages empathy. Masako Martha Hitayama. Takamoto says the community support to this day is heartwarming and that this place, this solemn spot, can continue to remind people that history should not be repeated. It should never have happened, I agree. And it's something that we hope will never happen again. On Bainbridge Island. I do wish that it doesn't happen to anybody else. Chris Daniels, King 5 News.